in this video we are going to prove that determinant of a joint of square matrix a is equal to determinant of a power n minus 1 let's suppose that we have matrix a which is n cross n which means that it is it is a square matrix and we know that in order to find inverse of any square matrix we use formula which is a inverse is equal to a joint of a divided by determinant of a now from this property i can shift this determinant a to the other side so i would write determinant of a or i can write a inverse times determinant of a is equal to a joint of a now if i multiply both of these sides by matrix a it would be something like that a times a joint of matrix a now from here a times a inverse we know that a times a inverse is equal to identity matrix of the same order as a so mat uh, so order of matrix i would be n cross n so i can write here identity matrix which is of order n cross n times determinant of a equal to a dot a joint of matrix a now let's take determinant on both of the sides so determinant of i dot determinant of matrix a is equal to determinant of a dot a joint of matrix a so this is a joint so this is determinant of a dot a joint of a this whole side now we have a property let's understand how to evaluate this portion now if we have an identity matrix of order 2 cross 2 and i multiply it by k then determinant of this whole thing would become equal to k square now if i have an identity matrix 3 cross 3 and i multiply this identity matrix by k the determinant of this whole thing would become k cube and so on if i have identity matrix of order n cross n and i multiplied by k then determinant of this whole thing would be k power n so there is the same case here i have a scalar determinant of a this is scalar so basically we have here determinant of a times identity matrix n cross n so it would be equal to determinant of a power n so I can write the left hand side equal to determinant of a power n because we had a scalar k here but we have a scalar determinant of a here so it doesn't make any difference and we have another property here that we need to use on the right hand side which is determinant of a dot b is equal to determinant of a dot determinant of b so I can write here determinant of a dot determinant of a joint of a. Now I just need to shuffle the terms and we will get our result. I can shift this side to the left hand side or let's divide both of the sides by determinant of a. Dividing both the sides by determinant of a. So this determinant of a would be as it is and determinant of a joint of a divided by determinant of a so this scalar and this scalar gets cancelled and I get here on the left hand side determinant of a power n minus 1 equal to determinant of a joint of matrix a so that's it so that was what we needed to prove that determinant of a joint a is equal to determinant of a power n minus 1 so this is our result i hope you learned something from this video and i will see you guys in the next video see you guys